Hi guys, good morning. I wanted to talk to you a little bit today about stress and its effect on your body and how you can use essential oils as a tool in support for helping you deal with that stress. So first let's address stress itself. Everybody knows that stress is bad for you, but how about a little bit of a scientific explanation about why prolonged periods of stress are bad for you? Because stress in short bursts is normal in our human makeup. Our bodies are designed to handle short bursts of stress well. But what happens when we're in a stressful situation is our body produces cortisol. Cortisol then um, provides the body with glucose by tapping into protein stores in the liver and then this helps in our fight or flight giving us the sugar we need to react in a very intense situation. But when we're under prolonged periods of stress, that means that cortisol level is higher longer, which means now we're talking about increased levels of blood glucose for longer periods of time. And when you have high levels of blood sugar, that's one of the things that contributes to inflammation in the body, and inflammation is the root of pretty much all disease. Okay, so maybe that will help you understand a little bit better why getting a handle on stress becomes really, really imperative. Now, the other thing that increased levels of cortisol do, and I'm sure most of you have experienced this at one point or another, you're having a stressful period of time, increased levels of cortisol actually interfere with our ability to learn. They interfere with memory. Um, they can decrease our immunity and they can increase our weight, right? Just as a small sampling of the things that increased levels of cortisol can do. So it's really important that we address stress and as a life coach, I worked with people for a long period of time, helping them navigate and utilize specific tools in order to be less stressed. And really, it all comes down to our personal choices. Um, what most people, I think in the beginning when stress is new, they start feeling out of sorts. So this is usually what I tell people and then I'll tell you how your starter set oils in particular um, can be very useful in helping you as a tool in your toolbox in dealing with that stress. So the first thing to do is really identify the root of the stress. So we all have a tendency to say, oh gee, you know, maybe taking care of my mom has, you know, made me a little cranky or maybe, you know, my marriage could be a little bit better or we shouldn't be arguing so much. We tend to live in a period of denial for a period of time before we have full acceptance that that is the issue at hand. So identify it, accept it, and then make a decision to change it right? That's what we want to do. Now, when we go about changing it, sometimes that situational change with hard choices that need to be made, sometimes changing it means empowering ourselves. And if we're going to empower ourselves, the first thing we need to do is bring ourselves to a level of less stress so that we can focus, so that we can be intentional in our actions. Because stressed out people, do not make good decisions, right? We just tend to do things on the fly. We tend to do things because it solves the problem temporarily and not permanently. And so it's very difficult in those moments of being really stressed out to sort of get a handle on life. So that's where essential oils can come in as one of the tools in your toolbox to help you decompress. So. First, let's talk starter starter set oils. These All three of these oils are available to you in your starter set when you become a Young Living member, which is why I'm so passionate about the starter set because it really covers various aspects of life and gives you a nice composite beginner collection to sort of address and start making your life better, right? In, in a lot of ways. So stress away is probably the number one um, blend that people go crazy for from Young Living. Stress Away is designed so that when you are in its presence, it is very relaxing, it is very grounding, and that combined with meditation, deep breathing, a little bit of yoga, 
um, just some quiet time. How about just some quiet time? Because if there's one thing that our overworked brains need, it's quiet. I don't know about you, but when I am overstressed, my brain like goes like this, like crazy, and thoughts go in and out like mad, and everywhere I turn, somebody wants something else from me, whether it's children or work or the phone ringing or a text message. So just going into quiet space and using your stress away either through tenting or putting it in your diffuser and just you know, give yourself 10 minutes. We're not, I, I understand how busy everyone is, but until you make a commitment to start ad addressing and handling the stress level that you're feeling, it is not going to get any better. So 10 minutes here, 10 minutes there, big difference. Lavender, also incredibly relaxing, incredibly calming, um, wonderful in your diffuser at night to help you get a good night's sleep. When we talk about living a life of wellness and and health and abundance we always talk about that it's not just one thing it's the whole circle of things it's the food it's the sleep it's the stress reduction it's getting chemicals out of your home it's allowing your body to flourish and function without all of the obstacles in its way which are typically what we put in our mouth, the toxic exposure that we have to household products when we don't know any better, toxic relationships, which also need to be addressed, right? Identify, accept, decide to make a change, right? Um, frankincense is also for me personally very helpful when I am feeling stressed. I associate the smell of frankincense with meditation. Um, often I will apply it on my chest and just sort of close my eyes and do a little bit of deep breathing. Again, even if I only have a few minutes, I also use frankincense before I go to yoga class. So I have retrained my brain to associate the scent of frankincense with a very enjoyable hobby of mine and so just the scent of it alone sort of puts me in that prepared to receive I'm taking care of my body physical wellness place and it can help me get there right away so all three of those come in the starter set so that's just like magnificent now beyond the starter set um, I have a couple of favorites that I'll share with you one is Palo Santo Palo Santo is holy wood. That is literally Palo Santo wood is considered holy wood. Many temples all over the globe have been built with Palo Santo. Um, there was some debate about, um, you know, biblically what was built with Palo Santo. But for me, this particular scent is incredibly, it invokes incredible feelings of comfort. And so, um, I just in particular, if you have the opportunity once you become a member to get a bottle of Palo Santo, that's like one of Sherry's absolute favorites. I will never be without this on my oil shelf. And the other one is grounding. And this is a blend, again, it is all about when we're stressed out, taking it down a notch. And any of our grounding oils, any of the big wood oils, pine, cedar wood, northern lights, black spruce, any of those wood type oils. Uh, what do you think of when you think of a big tree? Deep roots, held strong, steadfast, right? So that's a good way for you to remember the emotional benefit that those oils can have on you. And grounding has a great combination of those oils. So please get to a place where you give yourself a few minutes today assess your own stress level, decide, identify, accept. Accept that life does not always work out the way that we want it to, and we have stressful situations that we need to address. Spend some time in the silence, spend some time outside, if that's your thing. I also love affirmations. Um, when I'm done with my silent time, saying things like, I am powerful and capable of making my life the way that I want. I am worthy of receiving great love and abundance. And getting into the habit of doing those practices on a daily basis will get your stress level lower, those cortisol levels down, and make you feel like you are living a happier life.